Hello my YouTube friends! Have you ever wanted to add some simple flair to your live stream without a whole lot of work? Good! Me too! You're going to love this trick. Today I'm going to show you how to rotate a video or any asset really and even animate it. So you know what? Let's get to it! No need to set this one up. We're going to use simple assets and I'm sure you already have OBS installed. So let's dive right in. All right, let's start out with the super simple basics. What I'm going to do is go ahead and load a cam and load a camera in here. And we'll call it cam. We'll scroll down to the bottom. I'm going to use a custom audio device, select my audio. And there we go. And then I'm just going to shrink this down here like this. And we're going to load a video in. So we'll click plus. And we're going to go to media source and we'll just call this vid. Click OK. We're going to browse to our media source. And this is a long source, so I don't need to edit it or modify it. And we're going to shrink it down a little bit. And let's go ahead and just add a little bit of rotation to this to make it interesting. So we're going to right click. We're going to go to transform and we're going to go to a rotate. But we can go to edit transform and be more specific. So we can change the rotation right here to 45. Let's try 35 and close. And there we go. So now we've rotated the video and maybe we don't like that either. We're going to go to transform and edit and let's go with 15 degrees. I like that better. It adds a little bit of rotation and a little bit of character. So there you go. Now, you can beautify this up a little bit if you wanted to. The first thing we could do is crop our camera here to get us out of the way a little bit. So you hold down the Alt key and you just drag in the sides. And so now we can put this down so we're not blocking this. What we can also do is click the plus and we can go to our color source and we can add a color. Let's add kind of a blue color here and we can shrink this down. And we could do the same thing. We can right click and go to transform, edit transform. And we can rotate this the same way. And then go ahead and put this up here and stretch it down here. And then put it behind our camera and our video. And there we go. So now we have kind of a little bit of a background there. And we can crop it up to make all the sides equal by holding down the Alt key and just squeezing it in a little bit. And there we go, now we've got that. We could have a background picture and we've got something that looks kind of interesting. All right, so we're gonna add some zip to this just a little bit to make it fun. So what we're gonna do is right click and we're gonna go and duplicate our scene. And we're gonna basically mix it up. We're gonna move this over here and we're going to move these two, our video and our color source. We want to kind of move them together. And we're going to move those over here. And I grab my camera too. All right, fine. And then I'm going to rotate this again. So I'm going to right click. We're going to go into transform. And I am going to go ahead and edit the transform. And this time we're going to go with minus 15. And we're going to do the same thing for this. So we're going to go and edit, transform, edit, transform, minus 15. And then we're going to just bring it down here to where we would want it. We're going to do the same thing with our screen. So now we have this scene has it there and this scene has it there. So we can actually make this look like it's rotating and moving in a really cool way by using the move transition link in the description. Super easy to install. We just click the plus and we go to our move. Click OK. There's a busload of settings here that you can mess with. But to get the kind of look we're looking, we don't need to do anything. Now, there we go. And we've got a really simple super cool thing that you can do on your videos i could be talking about it right here point to it do any kind of commentary i want flip it over and then i can talk about it right over here but it just adds visual interest you can do it anytime during your video it doesn't mess anything up 
It's just really easy. And now you know how to rotate scenes, videos, whatever you want in your live stream. Pretty cool. I work really hard to try to create content that I think you're going to enjoy. And sometimes I hit and sometimes I miss, but it's really hard to know for sure. That's where you can really help me out. If you're enjoying this video, do me a favor and leave me a thumbs up. And if it's not your cup of tea, it is totally okay to give it a thumbs down. If everyone watching this video does that, it's going to tell me exactly what you think about this sort of content and put me on the right track. And I really do appreciate it. So hit those thumbs up and thumbs down. Thank you so much. Let's get back to the video. If you want to learn more about what you can do with the Move Transition plugin, and believe me, there is a lot more, let me know in the comments. And if you're looking for some tips to create an epic overlay easy, check this video out. And if you're always looking for tools, tips, and tricks to help make you a better live streamer or YouTuber, subscribe to the channel. My name is Michael Fire Jr. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day, and I'll see you in the next one.